Oh, I have not started the day. It's Jefferson. Tuesday. It is Tuesday. Tuesday. It was a Thursday. It's it right. was it was a Thursday like five days ago. It's Tuesday. Um, it's Tuesday. We were told by um, a viewer, five random guys, that City Barbecue had a mustard-based sauce. So we brought everyone here to City Barbecue to actually try it. So I, I just finished my pulled pork sandwich. It, it is. It was. It was good. It tastes really good. I've been doing the mustard on it's, your recommendation. It's. It's spicy. It's a little spicy, but it's it's good. I prefer mustard-based sauce. Kind of hard to get in North Carolina. Did you say it was sweet? Sweet and, sweet and spicy. Well, yeah, it's it's sweet, but you can taste the spice. You got like the the mustard. It's got like a tiny kick. Did you say? Go go have the bushfire sauce. Well, it's called bushfire. So that's spicy. I would it. imagine that's spicier. I did fry it. Anyway, how would you get? Um, I got, got a, a sample. Uh, so you get like a plate of meat. Brisk, yes. Basically. Brisket, uh, pulled pork, bread, and I got recommended. To, what was it? Okra. Fried okra. Fried okra. okra. Fried okra. Fried okra. It's yeah, real the, good. The okra here is real good. It's uh, it's a very very lightweight yeah. batter. Yeah, it's not mm -hmm. under an inch of an inch of batter. Which is typically how you get it. Yeah. So it's kind of odd that it's lightly battered, but it's good. It also comes with a little sauce, which I'm pretty sure is just some ranch it's sauce. Like meat ranch. Yeah, yeah. ranch sort of situation. Meat ranch? Meat ranch. Meat ranch. I think it has... Welcome to the meat ranch. Yeah, it's like bacon eggs. <laughs> oh, yeah, bacon eggs? Yeah. So we'll try it. No. It's advertised as served with I believe you. I don't have anything to dip it in currently. Right here. That's a French fry, Hal. <laughs> You're a French fry. <laughs> it is a good sauce. All right, well, let's see. Oh. There's, yep. a, yeah, there's also a... You've had okra before, right? Like, that's not new for you. Yeah. Maybe? I don't think I've had okra before. Oh, really? Those are good, though. Yeah. No, it's it's good. People people generally eat it. Yeah, it is meaty. Fried. There's something but about it's, that. But it's good other ways. I like it stewed with tomatoes. I, I do, too. like it, it roasted. It gets all goopy. Oh, I hate See, it. that's... Yeah, I... No, 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 no. No, no. When, when, no. Alex, when Alex and I started dating, he was explaining okra to me, and he's like, it's a pod, and it's goopy, and it's fuzzy, and I'm like, this is not delicious sounding. And then once I learned you can roast them, yeah, so good, so we, good. I'm try them roasted, because Stephen made them for me once, goopy, yeah. and I was, my stomach turned. Yeah. I will make them for you <laughs> roasted, and you'll be like, wow. There are many great. ways. So you J.O.'s used to make that was the thing you yeah. could get at J.O.'s. They had this, it, you know, yeah. it's, There's nothing wrong with it being good. I mean, most people don't like it that way. But it's like, that's... But it's fine. The goop is, you have to play to the strengths of the goop. So, like, a gumbo, when you put okra in gumbo, it, like, adds this nice, like... Consi goopy <laughs> consistency to your to your broth. Are you talking about slop again? <laughs> uh, so, okra, okra can be prepared in a way... So, like, if you prepare okra in a certain way, it becomes the texture of mucus. Oh. Yeah, yeah. And not very many people like it, but me and Alex do like it that way. Oh, it does it all comes back to slop. <laughs> <laughs> it's most people fry it and it is very good fry. So so on that one? The first one there? Uh yeah. Or yeah. I mean it could really be either of those, but that oh, one. Oh, I, oh me, the first one or this yeah. one? Yeah, just yeah, just for yeah, funsies. Yeah, yeah, just to on their way to murder someone you knew in high school. <laughs> and that oh. could be any. Could that be. could be Lindsay. That could be. Could be someone you don't like. Holding all of the pets. <laughs> oh that could be come on! <laughs> oh come on! <laughs> so Mal, you want to make a decision about think, which? Think, track think about you're Lindsay. Doing. Think about Stephanie. Murder clowns. That's what. One in. 125? Now it's going to sure. take your chances. <laughs> but think. Think about all the people you hated in high school. Yeah. They could be actually doing you a favor. <laughs> oh my god. We're screwed. <laughs> Did anyone from but your... Kepler. But it's, also it's think... Um, Man. You get to keep world, Kepler world, and achieve world, world peace if you just... Yeah, world peace isn't going to last too long if you got those dangerous yeah, aliens Yeah, but how else are we going to stick... Uh, st we can... It's gonna, you're going to achieve world peace and then immediately lose it. No, we're going to achieve world peace and stand in unison against that. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> the 
now they have lasers. But we have well. It's true. Peace. We have we never are developed unified lasers. This That's foreign. the one technology lasers that has, beat that has world beat. Beat. <laughs> humanity. For a few years, we'll have it real good. And then the aliens will show up we'll and ruin it. Kepler, <laughs> world peace. And that's all we need. Kepler but think of peace. grandma and her cookies. Oh, fuck grandma and her cookies. Now, certainly She's already made up your mind already, she lived right? In the last yeah. One. yeah. yeah. Internet Explorer written I mean, laptop. I would oh, also yeah. kill the clown of. Oh. <laughs> murder car. See? It's the an murder obvious choice. Murder clown car. Yeah. Missing Mexico. Yeah. But like this is India. That's tragic. Yeah. Atlas cut. Catless. <laughs> catless. It's his catless. Yeah. Alright, so at this point I'm supposed to give all of these to whoever had the most clairvoyancy, but it was a tie between Hal and Josh. Yeah, they had it the most. So I will just give it to Hal honorarily. So we have three. Hmm. Josh is suspect. We also have, oh, there is one in here. <laughs> Three. Mm. We also How have, about that? this is me, so I know which one this is. Three. Wow. Weird. So majority. <laughs> uh, yeah. Who's pink? Brandon? Brandon. Brandon voted for. Three. Oh, wow. Uh, this might actually be unanimous. Oh no. Dan voted for three. Ah, just kidding. <laughs> ah, I got you guys. Wait. That was that's all, all of us. That's all of us. So what do you think, Hal? <laughs> I think it might be three. And it is. Three! Yay! 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 I'm very curious. Uh, <laughs> so that was apparent. I guess that was very easy. These clues were shockingly perfect. They yeah. were. Rope. 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 Have it. Whatever. Have none, yeah, so. yeah, that was it. Yeah. That was it. Yeah, that the was boat good. Wrote none. I got when, when I got the boat. I was like, well, boat and boat is pretty good. Yeah. It was the nun on the boat with the rope. Yep. And she <laughs> sent, she sent people straight to heaven. <laughs> boat, 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 boat. It was mother boat rope. <laughs> so uh, heaven. Heaven. That, heaven. Well, heaven. Yeah, that's like, what I was thinking. Very so ethereal. Right, Heaven yeah. for none. This is just a rope. Yeah. And that is just a boat. Yeah. What should I set the temperature to? It's cold out. So I should maybe... It's like in the 40s tonight. So I should maybe have the heat on tonight? It's actually, it's almost in the 30s. It's a low of 35. So heat... 68. So yeah, it let's, can't let's fall do below. Actually, I'll just heat 67. No, I thought 68. 68. Okay. 69. 60. Nice. Um... Okay. Sure. So it's uh, just a little bit later. Um, Alex and Haley had things to do this evening after dinner, so they didn't hang out with us. But we hung out with uh, Hal, Brandon, Dan, and Josh. It was fun. It was fun. We played uh, a few different games this evening. And um, Mysterium. Yeah, I didn't get to. I didn't get to shoot Dutch Oops. Blitz because it's hard to shoot that and also play the game at the same time. But as always, frantic fun. Um, also said goodbye to Dan, who is going to be going 
back home tomorrow, so we won't see him until next week. Yeah. Because next week is Extra Life. Extra Life. Next Saturday. October 29th. I can't believe that it's already almost here. It's kind of wild. There's still things to do. It's fine. It's fine. I had a really good evening. Um, but I am very tired. Also, I, I did enjoy City Barbecue, and I appreciated it. I did, too. I appreciated the rec recommendation. It felt very close to Mission. Yeah. To me. Yeah. Um, there might be Mission Barbecue oh, around here, honestly. Mm, there's one in Fayetteville. Oh, okay. Mm. Out of the three barbecue places we've tried here in North Carolina, it, City Barbecue's been my favorite. Same. Same. And not even really close. Yeah. Yeah. I liked it. Um, cool. I'm sure we'll try more barbecue places. There is no shortage of no. barbecue. But... Oh, yeah? Not far from the one we were just at. Okay, so we'll we'll continue to try them. There are so many restaurants. Yeah, we could just eat at a new restaurant. There's so many, there's so many different places to eat. It's really nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Moving to, uh, I've, I've enjoyed living in Raleigh. Mm -hmm. I really have. Okay, uh, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?